road killer right now. And if you don't, I'm gonna have to you down on some Huh? Is that really? What the hell? <laughs> Who will I become next? Who the fuck is? Ah oh, shit! Here we go again. <laughs> yeah, boy. Rated PS for pretty stupid. Hey, chat. You have five seconds to subscribe. If you don't, I'm ending stream. Five, four. Oh fuck. Well, what the hell? Oh, damn, what is that? Sparkle trailer. Mono drama. Let's see how crazy she really is. Crazy? It's so funny that frame one, when I say that, she shoots me. Wanna play a game? Wanna play oh, she loves I was kidding. She playing Russian roulette? What the fuck? Oh my god, who gave her a gun? Nah, that's insane. Bro, I'm sorry. This is the most unhitched character. Are you kidding me, dude? I can fix her. I don't think anyone can fix her. Let's uh, let's be honest. Yo, she <laughs> is loco. And I love it. You're so now. Persona reference? <laughs> Holy Jesus. Oh my god, not the feet, bro, for free! When women sit like this, oh my god, yes! I have one weakness, and it is characters when they sit like this and look down. Genuinely. I'll be honest with you, Sparkle's one of the best design characters. She's like the Joker of Honkai Star Rail. Holy acid trip, bro. I'm speechless. I don't know how to react to any of this. Don't watch this video on drugs. <gasps> There's so many sparkles around her. Boy, it's a turkey. This is like a horror movie. What the fuck? Were you scared just now? Why how she know? I think that's the best trailer that Hawkeye Star Rail's ever put out. Dude, this is so good. Trailers. They actually gave her the best demo in the game. Like, like what? This is Kafka tier. So you know how everybody in this community has some character they're down bad for? Like Braxophone with Jing Lu, Tectone with Kafka, and Mr. Pokey with Jing Yuan? Yeah, well, Sparkle is that for me. But I'm just mentally ill and like women who hit me. I love, like, the introduction of Sparkle makes it so you can't trust anyone in Pentacony because anyone could be Sparkle. She's so mysterious, you know? There's something about her that makes you want to know her even more. I'm glad that it's not like, oh, I'm a little silly quirk sometimes it's like yeah no i'm losing it i want her to just be a blatant racist horrible human being you stupid shit on <laughs> one okay two yeah you know who's not getting a bye Luna today what the fuck this motherfucker wait 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 you know who's winning the 50 50? I think we're gonna win the 50 50. <laughs> I'm going to bet on my left nut. Oh my fucking god! Oh god, there goes my nut. Th Imagine losing two 50 50s in a row. Let me show you how the god of 50 50s wins every single. Shit on. I'm Sparkle. Where could I have seen you before? Can you figure it out? What were they thinking? This is insane. I think she's gonna open up some big doors for my account. I would rather you Sparkle over Bronya. Everyone likes a clever girl, right? Sparkle's technique grants all allies stealth for 20 seconds and makes you undetectable by enemies. More importantly, N3 battle while this is active will immediately recover 3 skill points for the team. That's a huge starting boost for your SP pool that will greatly help enable your SP heavy rotations early on and balance out her SP consumption. Watch this. What's going on in Miami, bro? No! Shit, this shit just why don't you stay and play for a while? Sparkle's talent, Red Herring, permanently increases the upper skill point limit by two points. 
now allowing you to hit 7 skill points total, but you still start with 3. Furthermore, when any ally consumes a skill point, all allies will gain a damage percent buff for 2 turns, stacking up to 3 times. It's beautiful! Come on! Huh? Ah! I need help here! Heroes never die! Let's kick it up a notch! While Branya has a 100% action forward on her skill with a huge damage bonus for a turn, Sparkle has a skill that gives you 50% action forward with a massive crit damage boost for a turn. This crit bonus is huge and it's higher than Branya's ultimate, and even though it's not a full 100% advance forward, 50% is still really significant and you can see her pull teammates up pretty dang far in the action sequence. It was time to do 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 Get over here! Don't move, okay? Oh shit, not good. What am I gonna do? Let's play hide and seek. She can increase the number of skill points of the team by four with her ultimate and also activate a nice thing called Cypher. Cypher, which is from her ultimate, amps up the damage increase by 10% per stack. As a result, you can gain up to 48% damage increase in battle, 16% per stack when Cypher is active, otherwise an 18% damage increase total without Cypher being active as each stack would then only give 6% damage increase overall. A thousand places in a thousand places. Can you find the answer? So this is Sparkle? Hey! Shouldn't you be in the- Where could I have seen you before? Can you figure it out? Boy, ain't no way, boy. Boy, ain't no way, boy. Who do you think Sparkle would be good for? Scylla? Genuinely? Scylla's getting a massive buff from Hanabi Sparkle. Scylla's gonna be incredibly valuable. I think she's gonna be an S tier unit. A lot of you guys are like QQ mans, right? But me, I like Zeal. Sparkle plus Zeal equals one of the most destructive combos possible. I, I think. Aha! Uh -huh. That'll come in handy. Let's push the envelope further, shall we? Pair up with. Ugh. All right. Let's do this. I promise he won't be bored with me. Another one. Be advised, I'm coming. Uh, I mean, uh. Disappear among the sea of butterflies. Caught in my. Nope. Light work, no reaction. Hold up. Wait a minute. Something ain't right. Oh no. Anyway. This combat needs optimizing. Oh. Let's play hide and seek. Let me end your music. Slash. Finish him. Check your balls. 